Hi guys, I'm Anastasia, I'm a luxury bag lover and collector and also owner of a consignment store. You can check out the link below to see what's available right now. In this video, I would love to share my thoughts on a speedy multicolor. If you're thinking about purchasing this bag, if you're dreaming about this bag, I would love to share some details with you for you to make a decision whether the bag should be yours. Maybe you'll learn something new that uh, will help you to make a choice. Actually, this Speedy is not a limited edition. It's a line that was uh, introduced in 2003 and uh, it was designed by the Japanese pop artist Takashi Murakami um, and it was huge, huge, big hit in Japan. But then it became a hit in other countries, as we already know. This Speedy is still one of the most popular Louis Vuitton Speedies at all. Whenever I have this bag in stock, I sell it instantly because it's someone waiting for uh, the multicolor Speedy. But I just wanted to share with you some insights on uh, the wear and tear of this bag and some details regarding the weight and other important details. Basically, I have a, a Speedy 30 bandolier to compare it to and to show you the differences, the pros and cons. First of all, this bag was only released in the size 30. There is no 25, there is no 35. Uh, there is also a very, very small Speedy from this line, but I mean, if you're looking for a medium size, that's the uh, only option. And I mean, if we compare it to a uh, monogram uh, canvas Speedy, they're quite similar, but the uh, basic difference, well, apart from the print, is the uh, Vachetta details uh, and all the um, hardware that this bag has. Important thing, this Speedy is quite heavy. Uh, you can see how many hardware elements it has. Of course, it gives weight to the bag, uh, so it won't be as lightweight as feather. However, it's not that heavy. I mean, you can wear it pretty easily and, well, it, it's quite a comfortable uh, shape and weight. Another thing I love about Speedy Multicolor is that uh, it keeps the shape. This bag is stuffed, but uh, it keeps the shape pretty good without stuffing. If we compare it to a uh, monogram canvas Speedy, th this one is stuffed too, but uh, it's sagging much more, probably because it doesn't have any fixation on corners and, um, well, actually nothing uh, is helping to keep the shape. You might want to use an organizer with this bag, but uh, it's more for organizing the things inside, right? and uh, not uh, giving shape to the bag. One more important thing, and uh, I guess that's one of the most important thing, things about this bag, is that it uses a different type of vachetta. I never encountered uh, this information online, but uh, I sold about over 10 Speedy Multicolors, I, I guess even over 20 and the vachetta on this bag is quite different it's very smooth um, it's easily cleaned and uh, i have a separate video on how to clean uh, multicolor bags i love this type of vachetta much more than the uh, vachetta on this bag on regular uh, monogram lines from louis vuitton because uh, th this uh, has more patina on it, this has less patina. Well, basically, uh, as it has less patina, it looks a little nicer, a little cleaner, and just beautiful, no matter how long you wear it. Again, this is a general thing, so if, if you have a bag and you've been using it since 2003, then, <laughs> of course, the Vachetta will get dark and it will be exactly the same shade as on any other Louis Vuitton bag that was used for over a decade. The good thing about this type of canvas is that it's not prone to cracks. Of course, I've seen uh, Speedy Multicolors in different conditions, guys, and of course, I've seen those that have cracks and that have canvas chips all over. But I mean, if you wear it every day uh, for 
several years, uh, for a decade, well, it's supposed to look like that because it's uh, not something that, uh, it, it's not a diamond, you know, that won't change its shape or color or anything if you wear it like 50 years. It's just a bag that will show wear eventually. However, if you buy this bag from the secondhand market, you can expect that uh, it will wear pretty good. It won't show a lot of cracks instantly, right? So you will be able to enjoy this bag a, a lot and uh, after a while then resell it or just leave it to your children maybe or take any other decision. Interestingly, one of the biggest Louis Vuitton markets is Japan. Uh, and Louis Vuitton is crazy popular in Japan and that's exactly the reason they are constantly collaborating with Japanese artists all over again uh, with uh, Takashi Murakami, Yaoi Kusama and all these crazy prints. I mean for Japan they are huge hits and uh, well we Western people may not understand at first the concept from a Japanese designer but then we fall in love with it as easily as Japanese do. And I constantly hear that uh, the multicolor line has been discontinued but just a few years ago I still saw it on the Japanese website and I guess in Japan it's still available because well when something is hugely popular well, then why discontinue it? This bag was actually super expensive it was over three thousand dollars and it made you a little bit hesitant to purchasing it especially if you don't have a large uh, collection with thousands of bags uh, I mean you won't wear it every day right? Well, at least not everyone will because it uh, has too much golden elements here. It needs a special occasion. However, um, as the bag has been discontinued in the US, um, you can find it on the secondhand market. And on the secondhand market, the price, well, for just a similar condition will cost you um, about 1000 maybe, which is more or less reasonable. It does have a lot of gold hardware and uh, from that standpoint you cannot wear it every day. Well, even with my current outfit, it's, it's pretty good. Maybe probably not the best choice, but it's pretty good. And uh, that's why I love the multicolor print and I can recommend it to you uh, because this bag is unique. This bag is beautiful. This bag does look very expensive. Well, some people may call it childish to me. I, I don't know why, I just love it. I, I love it and I fully understand if you want a bag like this. By the way, this beauty is available on our website and uh, you may check it out. It's a beautiful bag. All right, that was it. I hope it was useful and you learned something new about Speedy Multicolor. Thank you for watching, uh, subscribe to the channel to keep up with the latest updates in luxury bag world. Um, I also post a lot of video reviews, authentication videos and bag care videos. Thank you for watching, bye.